The House of Representatives has rescinded its earlier decision on three of the gender bills it voted against. That was during the consideration of 68 recommendations during the Constitution Amendment last week. The Speaker was speaking, uh, making the announcement that the decision by the House was to give the women a sense of belonging. This is especially coming at this time when the world is celebrating the International Women's Day. Emmanuel Ehijane completes the report. Speaker of the House of Representatives, Honorable Femi Bajabia Mila, made the announcement on the floor at plenary. This was after the House had held a brief executive session before the start of the day's legislative business. The Speaker said the House decision was born out of a quest for equity and for the good of the nation. There are issues arising therefrom, and the House in its wisdom has decided to take a course of action for the good of the country. And that action is to rescind three of the decisions that were taken on that day and after the rescission release them on the next set of amendments coming up. I believe, Deputy Speaker, in the next four weeks, in the, within the next four weeks, they, uh, it will come up again for, for voting. You recall that on the 1st of March, the House voted for 68 items in respect of a constitutional amendment. However, the aforementioned three bills could not stand through because you could not obtain the 35 the two third majority to uh, pass the bills. Federal lawmakers in the House of Representatives reacted positively to the decision to resign on their earlier decision. The women lobbied and they lobbied very, 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 very well. I think they did a good job. I will not uh, throw them under the bus and say they didn't lobby enough. They did a very, very, very good job. But again, like we said, culture and religion, they're as old as civilization. They are hard to kill, they are hard to bury, they are hard to forget. But we've done a good job today. Everybody came, everybody expressed their opinion, and we all came to a common ground that no, we have to do this. Though the fight for women, women inclusion has been on for over 20 years, since 1999. But for the past one week, the tempo has been higher than it was. And it is justifiably so. I say so because it's a moment in time for Nigeria to adjust her legal framework towards becoming better than we met it. And to achieve that, it must be holistic. Holistic in the sense that the hunger, the desire, the passion of every citizen of this country must be incorporated. The National Assembly rejected three gender equality bills last week during constitution consideration of 68 bills a decision which women groups across the country have rejected in all its entirety. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.